with the name above every other name. I hereby say, Alleluia. 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 Alleluia, it's an heaven language. Alleluia song, we never say so I'm out in Jesus' name. Good morning. Happy New Day. Happy Saturday, December 17, 2022. This is Love World, taking you open heaven, a guide to a close fellowship with God. Let's pray. Our Heavenly Father, we thank you. We bless your name. We appreciate you for giving us the grace and opportunity to be here today. Father, give us knowledge and understanding. Give us grace to be here tomorrow again. In Jesus' name, Amen. The topic before this morning is when God rises. When God rises. Our memory first shall be found in the book of Psalm 68 verse 1. I read, Let God arise. Let his enemy be scattered. Let them also hate him, flee before him. When God arise, let his enemy be scattered. Let them also that hate him flee before him. When God rises, an earth comes to every form of torment in the life of his children because the only enemy he has are those of his children. Sometimes, when God needs to get something done, he sends his angel and they will do the work. However, once in a while, he rises by himself and go to do what needs to be done. When God rises on your behalf, all your problems will be over. If you can master how to get God to rise on your behalf over and over again, no enemy will ever be able to withstand you. You can get God to rise through praise and worship. When you praise to Him, He will send an angel to bring answer to your prayer to you. But when you praise Him, He will come by Himself to receive your adoration. John 4 Verse 23 says, But the hour comment, and now is, when the true worshipper shall worship the Father in the spirit and in truth. For the Father seeketh such to worship him. In Acts 12, 3 verse 11, God heard the prayer of saints and set an angel to set Peter free. The angel went to the prison and set only Peter free. However, in Acts 16, 23 verse 29, when Paul and Silas praised God in the prison, he went here by himself into the prison, and everyone who was bound got loosed. In 2 Chronicles 20 verse 22 to 23, when Jehoshaphat led the people of Judah to war, the Bible says, and when they began to sing up to praise, the Lord set abushment against the children of Ammon. Moab and Monsia, which we are come against Judah, and they were smiting. For the children of Ammon and Moab stood up against the inhabitants of Monsia, utterly to slay and destroy them. And when they had made an end of the inhabitants of Seir, everyone helped to destroy another. God wants to arise and set you free completely. When you must do your part, Great time to worship God for all days and all time. Great time for Him, at least one hour a day. Praise Him until you can feel His presence strongly in the room where you are. Until you know that He has risen on behalf of and scatter all the enemies. Go ahead and praise the Most High God now. And He will hear you in Jesus' name. Brethren, I want us to read the book of Psalm 68, verse 1 to 4. And our Bible in one year, 1 Timothy chapter 6 and 2 Timothy chapter 4. Our hymn is in 16. O God, our help in ages past. O God, our help in ages past. Our action point for today. Praise God until arise on your behalf and scatter all your enemies. Praise God 
until he arise on your behalf and scatter all your enemies. Let's pray. In the name of Jesus, our Heavenly Father, we here today. We beg you to arise and fight for us. Arise and fight our enemy in the name of Jesus. Father, we bless you that you have done it. Thank you, Father Lord Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Brethren, this is Love World. Till I come your way tomorrow, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and click on the like button. And the goodness of God will never leave your life. Have a nice day. Have a nice weekend. And bye for now.